What clothes are best for when you have skin problems? Oh, is this? I think this is too tight. Oh, I can't breathe. My skin can't breathe. Oh, what? This one, yeah, I think it's gonna irritate my skin. Yeah, I don't know. And what? What fabric is this? I don't know if it's gonna be good for my skin. Mm. So when you have skin problems, it's always difficult to find what to wear, isn't it? Let's consider, let's consider different situations. For example, when it's winter, you usually put la layers upon layers of clothes and that's not good because the contact of the clothes to your skin might irritate it or it might make you sweat and if you sweat then you need to scratch yourself and when you scratch yourself your skin is going to get worse of course. So that's the problem I had during the winter months, so I, was, I didn't know what to wear and the, thing, the problem was also that since I had skin problems I didn't want it to be seen by other people so I tried to cover up myself as much as I could so that they could only see in the face if it was there but still you know I had that problem that I could feel that my skin was not breathing that you know all these clothes they were just they made me so uh, nervous and they irritated me a lot but when you are in summer situation might be better because you just have you know just nice um, clothes you know it's not winter that you just put a nice dress or something but we have another problem as well because if you have skin problems you might be embarrassed in front of other people because you don't want yourself to be seen you know by other people they might think oh my god what what does she have you know, you, you feel a bit embarrassed, you know, that's what I felt as well, so I know how you feel. And that's our problem, so what do you wear? You never know. You can put something like baggy clothes or something like that, and it's hot, you don't want to put loads of layer on you because then it's gonna, you're gonna sweat, it's gonna, you're gonna sweat a lot as well. So <laughs> that's our problem. Also, there are different types of fabrics. What What's the best for your skin? I usually wear cotton. I, especially when I had skin problems, I used to wear um, cotton a lot because, you know, it's not bad. Uh, at least it wasn't uh, rush on my skin and I avoided fabrics like wool. Oh my god, I hated it. And now that I'm vegan as well, I'm not using it at all. So it's always difficult because you know, you don't know what to wear in different situations. Uh, you know what fabric to wear. You feel like you feel like your skin is not breathing. That there's something wrong. But what I'm trying to tell you guys, if you're watching this video and you have skin problem, is that you have to change what you put into your system. Once you do that, your skin will heal. You will become normal again, and then you can wear whatever you want. Whatever month it is, it doesn't matter because now, you know, there have been skin problem three, four, two years, you know, I don't care if it's winter, I don't care if it's like uh, summer, if it's hot, if it's snowing outside, if it's freezing, if it's, if it's raining, uh, you know, if it's humid, whatever it is, I don't, I don't care because I can wear what I want because I don't have skin problems anymore. So make sure that you change your diet go on to a raw vegan diet which is the best or at least try the vegan one and try to avoid processed food as much as possible so in terms of what clothes to wear again uh, for me what worked was I especially cotton was really good and the kind of clothes not like super baggy clothes but you know that clothes that they were not too tight to my skin I used to wear leggings a lot because you know instead of like jeans because you can see if you can feel the difference uh, in the fabric it's not that rough on your skin and you know try different things but once you change your diet everything will change so that's the main thing change that and then you won't have any problems anymore so I hope you found this video useful and I'll see you next time with a new video. Ciao!